guys welcome back to my channel I hope you guys are having a wonderful day today I have my stitch fix to share with you guys if you're not familiar with what stitch fix is it is like a clothing subscription service so what you do is you go into their site and you kind of tell them things that you like the things you don't like if you don't want accessories you can tell them that or if there's items that maybe you don't want at all like shoes purses like for me I don't want any purses so I always tell them don't send me any purses because honestly I have enough I don't really need any more so basically what I want is clothing I just want stylish clothing like modern clothing and things like that so you go in there and you do that and then once you've done that you get your clothing sent to you and you pay $25 to have the clothing sent to you your $25 that you spend will go towards a credit if you decide to purchase anything out of the stitch fix so I typically at least find something that I can purchase that way there I'm not losing that $25 credit otherwise you will lose that $25 credit so for me this month I have done another themed box so my themed box is supposed to be themed around pretty little liars this is my third themed box I've done a sex in the city I've done a Gilmore girls and now we're trying out a pretty little liars so my stylist I told her that's kind of what I was looking for so I'm gonna see what kind of note she wrote wrote me so they always send you a little note. She says, hi, Tiffany, it's fixed day. That means I've got a box full of goodies just for you this time and a pretty little liar theme. I started with this denim skirt by Just Black that reminds me of Emily's casual tomboy style. Pair it with a Vicks B tie, front top, booties, and fun tights for a boho vintage inspired ensemble that Ariel would love. The West Key blouse would look cute with a denim skirt for a more feminine look. Try tucking the back in or leaving it out. It has the romantic glam and appeal of Hannah's style and does this and does this glorious, gorgeous, I'm sorry, floral maxi dress. Some of Spencer's polished preppy style to any of these looks, French mauve tunic blazer. The unique length will create great proportions with your tall frame and the olive color and weight make it look like, look like a perfect transition as we get closer to fall. And she says, have fun, Molly. So my stylist has been Molly for a couple months now and I love Molly. She's done a fantastic job. She gives me pieces that really fit my personality that I personally would not have picked for myself because I'm like, I don't know if that's gonna look good or not. And then I get it on and I'm like so surprised. So I've kept several complete boxes recently. So I'm hoping that'll be the case again with this box. You guys will have to let me know what you think of the products after I've tried them on and everything or the pieces after I've tried them on. I do have all the prices and everything. So again, your Stitch Fix will come in a regular box. So you'll get it in a box. And then they send you a little bag too. So just in case anything, oops, I just dropped the papers. Anything you do not like, you can just stick it in here and it's a self or it's a prepaid mailing um, envelope. So that way there you can send anything back that did not fit or just wasn't your personality or your style. So you can send anything back very easily. You don't get charged for those pieces that you send back. Any of the pieces that you want to keep, you can go ahead and just decide to keep those. You can go into your phone and pick out the pieces you're gonna keep and you can check yourself out. So it's really, really simple. I like it because for me personally, I don't like to go clothes shopping because I go in there into the store and I feel like I never find anything. I feel like she does a fantastic job of finding me pieces again that I feel like can kind of transition into different seasons and are appropriate for my age and then not only that are just kind of like classic pieces but also modern pieces so that they will go with the, the times now so let me grab this piece of paper I just dropped because it does have the prices on it all right so I've got our prices here so I'm going to go through and I'll tell you guys about the pieces and then my thoughts on them because I have tried them on already so that way there I can tell you whether or not I feel like they're good quality pieces and how they fit and, and how they feel and things. So the first thing is this dress right here. This is a dress and it's by, who is it by? This is by Kylie. So this is a Kylie dress and it looks like this. It's a black floral print with a semi wrap and it does tie on the side here. I thought it tied all the way around. I kept trying to tie it completely around myself and I'm like, no, there's no way because the tie is not long enough. So it just does tie on the side. So I really like that though because it makes it very simple. So you don't have to worry about keeping it tied all the time. Um, it does have the little hanger pieces. So if you're someone who hates those, I always cut these out because I use those felt hangers to cut the, the way there they stay on the hangers. But it's a very, very well made dress. It feels very luxurious. It kind of flows to the floor very easily. I feel like it just feels so nice on. It's a very soft and casual feeling, but also at the same time, I feel like something that you could definitely dress up. It does have like an extra piece underneath here. So you've got an extra little slip. So let me find the little slip here so I can show you. So it's the black with the flowers, but then it's got a black little slip under here. So that goes down to about your about knee length about. 
So that'll help to give you some extra coverage just in case you are concerned about being able to see through the dress or anything. So that is very important, especially for me because I try to be as modest as I can around my two boys and everything like that. So this is a very high quality piece. I love the way this feels. This is something that I personally would would have picked up into a store for myself if I would have seen it, but I have not seen this piece. So I'm really excited to actually possibly get this one. This is the Kylie Valeria Faux Wrap Drap Drap Faux Wrap Mini Dress, uh, Maxi Dress. Goodness gracious, I could speak, that would be great. So, and they call it the shade black. It's a size medium and it's $68. $68, honestly, I feel like that's Kohl's pricing. Kohl's pricing is around the same price. Like if you get something from the Chaps line or something like that, that's about the same price for Kohl's. So I really like this piece. I really, really like it. I like that it accentuates my waist and everything like that. Not that it felt like it made me look smaller, but it just made it look like more hourglass feeling. So I really love the way this dress feels on and everything. I think it might look cute with the blazer that's in here too. So you could probably put these pieces together. So I really love this dress. This is something that I, I'm seriously considering keeping. I'm actually considering keeping the whole fix, to be honest with you. The next one is this right here. This is by, West Key. So here is the dress or dress. Here's the shirt. It's a very sheer type of shirt. It does have these little ties here on the sides, which were a little bit difficult for myself to do. I mean, if my husband or somebody was home, then they could help me tie them. But I had a little bit of an issue trying to tie them myself. So I don't know what I would do to help fix that problem. But it's a really cute shirt. It does have like a little bit of a wrap going on here in the front. The wrap, I don't think you can actually go all the way through. Uh, yeah, if you push really far around, you can. But it's a little bit of a wrap going on here and it kind of pinches itself up so it almost balloons under a little bit so it gives your body that cute shape and then in the back here it has a little bit of a longer back to it so it comes down over your bottom so if you wanted to wear this with leggings i think you could this is a really cute shirt as well i love the material because i feel like it'll be perfect to transition from summer to fall and into spring again so i think it's a perfect piece um this one is the who did i say this was by oh my goodness West Key. This is the West Key Allen Tie Sleeve Blouse and it's red and it's a shade of medium and it is $38. So I feel like $38, again, I feel like the pricing this time around, I feel like she did a really good job of keeping my prices kind of low. So it's just something else that you can ask your Stitch Fix stylist to do. You can ask them to keep your prices within a certain range because I don't want the most expensive pieces because honestly, I just don't like spending a lot of money on clothing because I am one of those type of, pre type of people that I like to wear different clothing. I don't like to wear the same thing all the time. So. This is a really nice piece though, so I really do like this. This is something that I really think would make a good piece in my closet because I feel like you could wear it with so many different things. You could honestly wear this with shorts, you could wear it with a skirt, you could wear it with shorts, I just said shorts. You could wear it with pants, anything you could possibly think of. I just think it's a really nice piece. The next one here is something that I like it, but I'm not so sure about the sleeves to it. The sleeves are a little snuggle me. So this is by Vixby. So this is in the size medium and I feel like the sleeves, I don't know if you can tell it, <clears throat> sorry, if you can tell it in the video or not, but I feel like it's a little tight when it's rolled up. I feel like it's a little snug on my arms. And I have that issue sometimes with shirts because I don't know if it's because my arms are like chunky or I have no idea what's going on there. But either way, they just don't fit my arms exactly how I would like for them to. I like my shirts to be a little bit looser on the arms just because I'm very self-conscious about that anyway. But this is a more of a thinner style shirt again, so I think you could definitely transition this one from summer to fall and into spring. I'm not sure it would be a great winter shirt, <clears throat> losing my voice, but I feel like it would be definitely good for spring, summer, and fall. So it's a really cute piece again though. I like how this one here ties in the front. It's got the little area where you can tie it all the way up. It just looks really cute and stylish and I think this one actually would look really cute with a pair of shorts as well because of how it ties and everything. It looks kind of beachy and it does have a little bit of a longer tail at the end so it's going to cover your bottom if you're concerned about that. So this is by Vixby and it's the Thompson's Tompkins tie front, no, tie front top and it's $42. Again, the pricing I don't feel like is bad. I feel like their pricing is on par for the quality and everything of the clothing. The quality of Stitch Fix, Stitch Fix clothing has always been superior for me. Everything I've gotten, I've washed it, worn it, and it's done really well. So I have had no issues whatsoever from anything I've purchased from Stitch Fix. So I'm really enjoying this piece as well. So I don't know, just the sleeves is what bothers me. The sleeves is what scares me a little bit. The next thing is this right here. This is a skirt. 
Now, I'm someone, I'm not a huge denim fan for like skirts and like jackets and things like that, but I do like to have an occasional piece here and there. So this is one that I have not owned a jean skirt and a, or a denim skirt in a very, very long time. So this might be one that I end up keeping. So this is made by Just Black and it's a size medium. It has a, quite a bit of stretch to it. So if you have bigger bottom like I do, it's going to fit you. Not only that, you're not gonna have to worry about like unzipping it and unbuttoning it and things like that if you need to use the restroom because it's got a pretty good stretch to it. It also has a little slit in the back here which I think makes it look a little bit more feminine. It's like a pencil skirt. So I think that the style of it makes it look kind of office appropriate. So maybe like your Friday office attire. So you typically a lot of offices let you wear jeans on Friday so you could wear a jean skirt on Friday. I just think it's really cute and it's a darker jean wash. So I like the dark jean wash. I like the faded wash for jeans but for a skirt like this I'm glad they made it like a darker wash. So this is by Just Black the Francis Denim Skirt and it's in the shade Navy and it's $58. So for the quality of this and how it stretches and everything, $58 again I feel like is not bad at all. And you gotta remember too, if you fall in love with all of your pieces and your stitch fix, you can always take off your percentage that you, I mean not your percentage, but your styling fee that you paid, plus you can take off 25% off the entire fix. So you can bring it down a pretty good amount by just by doing that. And then the last piece I have here is this. This is a little jacket and it's by French Mauve. So this is the jacket she was talking about in the little description. I love this jacket. I love the detail to it. I like how it's like hemmed here, kind of like gives you a little bit of covering on your bottom. I like how it kind of swoops up for the jacket where the pocket goes. I really love that detail. I like that it's cuffed. It's a different material. I'm not sure what this material is actually. Let's see what we can find that. Um, it says it is 97% polyester and 3% spandex. I'm not sure. It feels almost like a crushed material. So it feels a little bit different. I do like how it feels though. It's very, very soft. So I'm not going to, it doesn't feel itchy or anything is what I'm saying. Sometimes I've gotten jackets before where they're itchy or they're constrictive. And this one is neither. It's not itchy and it's not constrictive. So I feel like this is a really great jacket. And like she said, I feel like this color is going to work great for the fall. So this is something that I definitely want to keep as well. I think, like I said, it would look really cute with that dress. Where did I put the dress? Oh, uh, here it is. I think it might pair really well with this dress as well, just to kind of throw over top of it as a fall little outfit here. I think that might look cute. So this is something I really like as well. So this jacket here is French Mob. This is the Melody Knit Tunic Blazer, and it's in the shade Olive, and it's $88. So that's my most expensive piece out of my entire fix. So, and I really love this. So for me, if I were going to keep anything out of it, the only thing that I'm not totally in love with is the black and white shirt. So for me, it would be cheaper to keep the entire fix if that's the case. And honestly, you could actually sell it because I know a lot of places you can sell like your stitch fix items that you really don't love. I think there's like a Facebook group that you can sell on too. So I'm not interested in doing that, but just in case you get a fix that you're like, no, nah, I'm not so in love with this one piece, but I want to keep everything else and still get the discount. So this says my total would be $294. If I decided to keep everything, it'd be deducted uh, $73.50. And then my styling fee credit of $20. I'm sorry, it's a $20 styling fee credit, not $25. I messed up, so sorry about that. I don't know why I thought it was $25. Uh, so my order total would be $200.50. So I personally think for $200, considering this is $88 alone, I feel like it's a, it's a deal. So I've got five items here. So if you divide the five by $200, that's only $40 per item. And I feel like everything in here is definitely worth $40 or more. So... I really love this fix. I am debating if I should keep it all. My husband's gonna kill me if he sees me keeping all these clothes all the time. He's gonna be like, how many clothes do you need? You, well, I guess not much, cause, or he probably won't say much cause he sees how much makeup I have. He's totally just gonna be like, well, at least it's clothes and not more makeup. But anyway, so this is my stitch fix for this month. I really think Molly did a fantastic job. If you're interested in requesting Molly, I think you can do that as well. If you sign up for stitch fix and you wanna request her, just ask for Molly. You can ask for any of the pieces that I have here today because I will have them listed below as well as my referral link. So if you sign up using my link, you get your first fix for free so that we're there. You don't have to pay anything. You can just get the box sent to you and try everything out to see how Stitch Fix feels for you. Maybe you can do a uh, themed box. So like now I'm trying to think of another themed box that I want to do, but I'm not exactly sure what it is going to be yet. So I'm kind of start thinking about what I could do. If you guys have any ideas for a themed box, let me know because I loved these themed boxes because I think that they, she's done a fantastic job with those. So anyway, I'd love to know your thoughts, your opinions, and whether or not you've signed up for Stitch Fix and if you had good luck with them or not. And of course, 
If you have any questions about this at all, just leave me a comment in the comment section below and I will be sure to answer you. Thank you guys so much for watching and until next time, I'll catch you guys later. Mm -hmm.